Hello, six metal stars. You have worked hard and you've prospered and I hope that you let the good things find you in 2022 as you are coming off the most lucky six metal year where you were reaping rewards and hopefully something good came your way last year and you are going to continue now in that metal star energy as you move into the seven metal star you'll be feeling right at home still for a whole nother year and now is your time to really relax and enjoy the fruits of your labor this is called the second harvest so 2022 was your harvest year where things could come to you but you may have found you were doing lots of work just like the farmer or out in nature when you're out harvesting the crops and then there is this year 2023 which is called the second harvest and it is a more relaxed time where you just finished receiving receiving all the things that were coming to you and you may have another big payday and this time you can do something splurgy maybe you go on a big vacation you do some traveling or you just take some time off this would be a wonderful year to take a sabbatical from your profession maybe you're feeling a little burned out and you want to do something else and maybe you have enough financial resources now that you can give yourself a little break to just take some time out and think about what it is you want to do next and take a moment now in this 2023 year to have gratitude this will be a wonderful year to start a gratitude journal just get a blank journal and start writing all the things you're grateful for if you can write three things that you are grateful for each and every day it is amazing how you can manifest with the power of gratitude and we just made some really cool journals on we're posting them on amazon and i'll post a link down below if you're needing a new journal but really taking your time every day to appreciate what it is you do have and it can just be enjoying the brilliance of a setting sun maybe going on long sunset walks with somebody you love and enjoying the nourishing foods instead of just eating maybe you place make a placemat and you set the table and you light a candle and really be here now experiencing all the wonder in the world the simple things like just looking at the artwork in your home or maybe you want to beautify your home because you will be more sensitive now to your surroundings you may suddenly notice something in your house that is dusty or like a painting that you're like i don't even really like that painting why has that been there for 10 years and you want to just revitalize your home this would be a really good year to do an energetic space clearing and just really clear out the old energy declutter and get your home feeling like you want it to feel just having all that beauty and really good chi and just tidy up get rid of all those things that don't spark joy and you will be also more sensitive to negative energy coming from other people so you'll want to surround yourself with some really high vibrational friends and if you have somebody negative at work you're just going to want to kind of steer clear because metal energy as you're in this metal star metal can be so sensitive to the energy around it when it's hot outside metal gets hot when it's cold outside metal gets cold and so just like you will be you are a metal star and you're traveling through a metal star this is double metal this makes you so sensitive to the words people say 
or just sensitive to the energy, you might find yourself really noticing the energy of a room or a workplace or an environment. So you'll want to be in good, healthy environments with good people and this will be just the perfect year to take a trip or to go traveling and try to get yourself in the most beautiful places with waterfalls and hot springs and turquoise Caribbean waters, you know, really taking it all in and maybe taking lots of photographs or painting. You're going to be feeling more artistic in this seven metal year. So take some time out to really experience all the beauty that surrounds you as you venture forth on an adventure. And I hope that you really can take some time, good time off work and enjoy the energy that is coming in and that good things find you. And if you would like to know more about how this seven metal year is going to be affecting you personally, I am doing a sale right now on personal nine star key astrology readings where I read all three stars. We actually, each and every one of us come in with three stars, not just one. So I go to a, a deeper level with the three stars and really let you know how to align with the energy of 2023 to manifest all that you desire and to manifest those beautiful places and where you should go. And, and I'm also doing a Vela, which goes into a deeper dive about the meaning of the seven metal star. And those will be available on Amazon. I'm gonna to link to all of it down below. And I hope you have a magical, 2023 year and that you are so grateful for all that you have manifested already on the way to manifesting even greater abundance. Thanks for watching.